Hello Libra, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is your weekly reading for week commencing 12th of November 2018 for the sign of Libra, Sun, Moon and Rising Sign. I hope you are Libra. So here are the cards. We have the Three of Swords, the Five of Cups, the Seven of Wands, the Six of Swords, the Two of Swords and the Two of Cups. And I've also pulled a couple of Archangel Oracle cards for further clarification. So I'm going to start with, um, yeah, I'll take the Five of Cups and the Three of Swords together. So, yeah, the Three of Swords can be about um, at its extremist point, it can be about heartbreak, um, it can be about upset, being about deeply hurt, deeply let down, and um, betrayed. Um, the swords going through the heart, swords represent truth and clarity. Um, so there's a brutal realisation of a situation for some of you as well uh, that hasn't been pleasant. Um, but you're healing from it now, Libra. You're healing from it. You see this kind of like um, a sun symbol in the middle. You're healing from it and it's healing from within. Healing from your own strength, your own beliefs, your own courage. And yet, for some reason, you're hanging on to the situation. This is the Five of Cups. This is mourning what's lost. Now, this could be the loss of love. It can be the loss of a job. It can be, um, you know, uh, it can be losing faith in something. Uh, it can be losing hope, losing beliefs, um, losing who you are, losing a sense of self. This, I mean, as I say, I mean, it's about clarity, so you know the way forward now. And it starts the healing process. So the idea of this card is to move on from this card now, move on from this negative energy. But for some reason, some of you are holding on to the past. Some of you are holding on to situations that don't serve you anymore. And you're mourning what's lost. This is the card of mourning what's lost. But you're not seeing the wider picture, the fact that there are two perfectly happy cups um, of opportunity, of fulfilment, of uh, potential that surround you. Um, but you see, he's mourning what's lost, he's mourning the three cups that have fallen on the floor, not what he still has. And you need to, I guess it's a kind of like life review, you need to look at your life now and see what changes you need to make to suit you and also awaken to your own potential your own possibility awaken to new possibilities for the future you know and be be open to um all opportunities so this is about opening your mindset opening your mind where it might have been closed off to love where it might have been closed off to certain individuals where you might have struggled on the work front um, open your mind now to new opportunities um, to having new happiness in your life to having new hope to having new faith in your life to having faith in your ability having faith in your own strength having faith in your own capabilities Libra and it takes a lot of determination. This is a card of facing your obstacles and overcoming them, you know, trying to overcome them. This is a card of not resting on your laurels, but continuing to keep on battling on, to keep on facing your adversity, to stand up for your beliefs, and um, to stand up for what you believe you're capable on what you want in life this the, the ones represent opportunity uh, potential and um, they also talk about taking action maybe after a period of inaction maybe you've been stuck in this negative mindset and it talks about breaking free breaking free to seize opportunities and push past negative situations you see the open door it's an open door of opportunity libra this is a, an open door, you know, to opportunity, to potential. This is what I'm talking about, the awakening um, within you, uh, being more aware of your surroundings, opportunity around you, and not focusing on this one thing that's gone, but focusing on the bigger picture and what's in store for you, you know, 
grabbing hold of potential with both hands like this man is and fighting on and if people do say um do tell you to take time out to recover mull over the situation you have to ignore them in some respects because they're not doing you any service this is a time now for beginning to take action make decisions and move forward with your life and with hope and with new opportunity um, and find out what is behind your door your door of opportunity and this is a card of you moving on so I do think that for some of you you recognize the situation and you start to move on and this is about it can be about travel maybe you go on a holiday maybe you go and have a break it might be travel um, associated with your job it could be a new job um, it can also be about moving home this card um, so yeah I mean as I say I mean this is about moving on more than anything it's, it's going from the choppy waters to calmer waters with hope with renewed faith with um, a new sense of self having learnt the lessons from this negative situation and taking on board that which makes you stronger you know and realizing that you're a stronger person as a result of the situations that you've been through and you're going through forward now with truth and clarity you see their swords truth and clarity that's exactly what they represent and they're balancing the boat they're providing balance for you they're providing a clear focus for you the souls represent mental energy mental intellect uh, mental focus mental problem solving and this is exactly what they're doing for you now they're providing the path forward so you'll see your path clearly you'll come out of this situation um, snap yourself out of the situation, battle forward, persevere, face, you know, those people who may well be challenging you. This might well be an area where you might be challenged, but you're overcoming it because you're moving forward. You're pushing forward now. And you may well have, you may well have wobbly moments, Libra. Um, this week, there may well be a, a feeling of two steps forward, three steps back. Um, but know that you are progressing overall. You are progressing, you are healing from this situation. Whether it's love, whether it's in the workplace, whether it's general friendships, whether it's work colleagues, whether it's wider acquaintances. Um, know that you are moving on. This is a card of moving on and this is a card of making choices. But you're refusing to make choices on the situation. You may well be struggling to make a choice. Um, maybe it's the final point where you cut um, this negativity out of your life, where you decide to move forward. This woman in the picture has um, a blindfold on. She could easily take this blindfold off and see the truth and clarity of the situation, which is what the swords represent. But she's... Um, reluctant to and it's going to keep us stuck so the warning of these cards is that to move on you have to make decisions you have to persevere you have to face some people who may well want to say oh it's fine to stay in this negative state of mind but it isn't you need to push forward and move on now and take action take action move forward have the clarity of mind to move forward and focus on your goals again what do you want in life? What do you want in your personal life? What do you want in your professional life? What do you want financially? You know, who do you want to keep in your life? This is a card of, you know, making those choices now, Libra, and having the conviction to see your path clearly and deal with the situation to release yourself. So this is about, it is about releasing yourself this week. And once you do, once you make those choices, I just feel this is a journey back to you again. This is a journey about finding you. This is a, a journey of self-discovery. This whole thing is about self-discovery. It's about having conviction, having courage, having faith again, having hope. Um, this also might well be new love. After a period of being hurt, you might end up with love. But I kind of think for some of you, this is loving yourself first. Um, you know, love yourself first so that other people can love you. 
because, you know, value yourself, Libra. Find contentment in appreciating the journey you've been on, however tough that might have been, and give yourself credit for moving forward and not allowing yourself to be stuck. You see, this, this is about awareness as well. This is about emotional stability and awareness. And you see the moon here. I don't know if you can see the moon in this card. It's quite clouded, but you see the moon in this, in this. This is talking about using your intuition to create your own happiness, to move forward, to push past obstacles in your way. And once you do, you'll be happier for it. And as I say, this could be new love coming into your life as well for some of you. Um, but there's a real emotional stability. There's an emotional balance. Maybe after a period of imbalance, there's a real balance. And there's a balance here as well. Pushing forward, go, moving forward now to a balanced outcome and feeling more balanced within yourself. Maybe between your internal, external worlds. worlds. Maybe emotionally you're feeling better, emotionally you're feeling more capable um, and, you know, physically in your world, maybe you've taken action to remedy certain situations that have hurt you in the past so you can move on and move towards your, um, yeah, move towards your future goals. This is, you know, moving towards your goal. This is a path that's clear to you now. So don't let negative situations, this situation, cloud you. You see how the cards relate to each other? Don't let the situation cloud you anymore. Um, five is absolutely a card of instability. And, and two is kind of like, you know, it is about choices. It is about making sure that you don't remain stuck in this situation and having the courage to see it for what it is. And it's not as bad as you think. As soon as you face things, Libra, things aren't as bad as they you thought they would be. So this is Hello from Heaven, Archangel Azrael, your loved ones in heaven are doing fine, let go of worries and feel their loving blessings. Hello from Heaven, Archangel Azrael, your loved ones in heaven are doing fine, let go of worries and feel their loving blessings. It might be actually just... You know, it's, it's popped into my mind, so I will say it. But it might well be you are being watched over. You know, this could be... I just feel maybe you are being watched over um, and guided and protected. Um, yeah, maybe, you know, you are getting some spiritual strength from that as well. And the next card is Courage. Archangel Ariel, be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. So courage, Archangel Ariel, be courageous, which is this card here, and stand up for your beliefs, which is absolutely this card. And as soon as you, as soon as you stand up for what you believe, as soon as you see that goal in sight, you can move towards it with clarity. But just don't let anybody or any other situation keep you stuck. These cards are real feelings of feeling stuck and... As I say, I'd hate to think it's two steps forward, three steps back. You have to have a clear purpose now. This is clear purpose and see the truth for what it is, Libra, and move on. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. And just to let you know, um, if you haven't checked it out, the December readings are out now. So if you haven't seen those already, do check those out and... I hope it's a great week and I'll see you next time. Thank you.